Hello, um, this tutorial is going to be um, a tutorial on WordPress blog. Um, if you have uh, a new installation of a WordPress blog and you're not sure where to start and how to use it and everything like that, this is going to be the tutorial for that for those. Um, and I'm hoping that it'll help you figure things out a little better. So I'm going to use my website here um, as an illustration. Um, so if your WordPress blog is installed directly on, on your domain, meaning that it's not in a separate directory, um, then if you go to your domain, you should see something like this. This is a default installation, default theme. Uh, if you have a custom theme that's installed, it'll, yours will look a little different. But the main idea is that there's the content area here and then the sidebar with your categories and pages and things. Um, your sidebar may be on the left side, maybe on both sides, it may vary. So, But this is a basic uh, default installation that you can look at and kind of have a, an idea of what, what's going on here. For you to get into the administration side, uh, you can either find a login button in the meta uh, category here on the, on the sidebar um, if you don't have it here, you can just basically go to your domain slash wp dash admin and that will bring up the login screen. And just log in here. And this is what you're going to see. Um, from here, you can do uh, pretty much everything to uh, manage the blog. Um, you're gonna write a new page or a new post uh, by clicking on this, the write new post button on here. Um, or you can also click on write up here and then choose post here. Um, so for you to create a new post, all you need to do is put in the title. And then uh, write your post in this box. And I'm, I have a, a, some text uh, saved in my uh, clipboard, so I'm just going to paste it here. Um, you want to uh, see here that uh, on the bottom right corner of this box you can actually click or grab it and drag it um, to open up the text box so you can see what you're doing um, if you need to add an image to this just click where you want the image to go so we're gonna put it over here on the top left then click on this button where it says add media and then click choose files to upload and just browse to wherever your file is that you want to upload and then you can put a title in here you can put a caption um, this text actually goes underneath the image in a little white box um, so if you want that there you can enter some text in here. If you don't want that box to show up, um, then don't put anything in here and it won't. Um, you can experiment with it just to see what it looks like, see if you like it. Uh, you can add the description and then you can also add the URL link here. Um, just uh, basically so if somebody clicks on the image it'll take them to wherever your URL points. You can do alignment here uh, align the image either to the left or to the right. We're going to do left. And then specify the size of the image that you want to show on the, in the post. The full size will actually show the, the full size of the image that you uploaded. A medium will actually size it down to a, a pre-specified size which you can modify in the, the preferences of the WordPress blog. And the thumbnail will actually give you a smaller size which you can also uh, specify in the preferences. But for now, we're just going to go with medium and insert into post. 
and there it is if you don't like how it looks or you want to edit it or anything you just click on the image and click on the little uh, picture here and it'll bring up the thing where you can uh, modify it and let's say we want to put it on the right side and then we just update and there it is on the right side um, you can use these tools to format the text um, add links also if you know HTML you can click on HTML to modify the HTML code otherwise we just go back to visual and scroll down here you see the tags area you can add the tags and these are basically keywords uh, so if this text was about lorem ipsum which is what it's called I guess we'll just uh, put that in there and then you separate them by comma so I'm gonna go like that and if I misspell that just ignore it I'm not an expert on lorem ipsum uh, categories you wanna put this post into a category you can either choose the existing category just by putting a check mark in there you can use uh, if this applies to a couple of different categories you can put check marks in the two categories or however many categories you think it applies to you can also create a new category by clicking here and then choose if it's a parent category which means that it's a main category or you can choose to make it a subcategory of, a, of one of the existing ones and then we'll just go with parent add and there it is um, this here is advanced options which you probably shouldn't use unless you know specifically what you want to do with it and then basically up here just uh, click publish um, if you want to save it and not publish it um, to work to continue working on it later just click save and that will just save it and it won't show up on the front page uh, so we'll just click publish and it is ready to go um, you can click on the visit site over here to go and look at it so that takes us back here and there's our uh, title our text our picture Here's our uh, tags, and if you click on one of those, it'll take it'll open up a list of any posts that are marked with these tags. And there's our another cat that we created, and I guess that will be it. Uh, you should know how to post in your blog now. Uh, thank you very much for watching. We'll see you later.